we need one banana. I'm going to bring it over here. I'm going to peel it. And now we're going to grate it just like cheese on a cheese grater. And now we're going to peel the rest of the banana and we're going to grate the second half. We're going to take some chocolate chips and sprinkle them on top. Over here, I have a spatula. I'm going to dip it into my batter like this. We're going to place our banana like this. And we're going to cover it with the rest of our batter. We're going to come over to our hot oil, 350 degrees, and we're going to pop that right in. Our second one. Our banana fritters are nice and golden, and we're gonna take them out of the oil. Add a little powdered sugar. I'm gonna take bananas and bring them over to my cutting board. I'm gonna start cutting in the end of bananas like this, and we're just gonna cut them straight through the middle. I'm gonna go all the way down to the end. up through the stem. We're going to pull off the top. We'll set those to the side and we're going to take our bottom bananas over to our plate. I have a little cinnamon sugar here and the blowtorch. We're going to give it a caramel crunch. This is just like a creme brulee. We're just going to slowly pass the blowtorch over the sugar. It's going to caramelize it. And you can go back over any areas that didn't caramelize completely. We're going to do our second banana. It smells so amazing. Cinnamon, caramelized sugar. And now we're going to add a little bit of toasted almonds for crunch. Now it's time to put it all together. We're going to place our banana fritters right in the center of our caramelized bananas. We're going to add some ice cream, vanilla, chocolate, and strawberry. And you can't forget the whipped cream. Some chocolate sauce. And the cherry on top.